Hello friends, welcome to another episode of Greg Professor's Crypto Winter's Journey. We are into week number six. Let's get straight into it. We are going to see the Terra's airdrop. Is it some consolation to the losses it has given us? We'll see performance of various chains. Which chain has recovered? Which chain is doomed? So let's get started. We start off with Binance, not much of an action there. The investment is protected because most of it is in Binance USD and Binance USD is holding its peg. Binance Vault is giving Project Galaxy not much of an action there. This total yield and ROI is because of the last week's $45 profit reinvestment in Binance USD. So let's go to Phantom. Phantom is almost dead. The reason I'm saying this is because the liquid driver is giving only 67% yield and that to distribute it in numerous coins. Anything above 110, 120 is good enough for a large distribution but this is not going to give me any significant amount in a single coin. Uh, just look at this value this has gone down from one and a half dollars although the quantities are increasing that goes to show that all the phantom coins are going very very we do not expect tomb to recover any soon because the de-pegging of tomb from phantom is far off the peg so one tomb is almost equivalent to point four zero five six phantom so this is what is happening in the phantoms blockchain just look at this total yield uh, it's a little improved over the last night's entry here but not much of an action i would say it is doomed let's go back to cosmos cosmos is really really disappointing atom holding at less than 11 dollars osmosis from 11 dollars to 1.4 dollars one good news is that usdx in the kava app has recovered a bit last week it was off peg by 20 cents now it is off peg by only 10 cents so this is one good news that this is recovering and probably that is the reason this thing has also improved a bit because an investment of 14 dollars in usdx is currently sitting at 13 dollars in kava hard and kava swap are being yielded by usdx in kava app so we can see that it still is yielding uh, at a pretty decent rate so it is yielding at a 50% average for Atom, Akash and USDX which is not bad because Kawa is holding up pretty well I would say this chain has not gone down too much but at the same time hasn't moved up significantly Kronos is Kronos has done well Kronos has done well last week it was almost half its total investment now it is above half and you can see there isn't much change in the price action although today it is showing a better result than the previous week's result I entered these values yesterday so Kronos otherwise um, is at 20 cents 19 cents uh, almost half from its top not bad Akash is holding at 43 cents. Let's move to Moonbeam. Moonbeam's price hasn't changed much. The total investment of 100 has reduced to 22 only and there is a slight improvement on ROI and yield here. Because Moonbeam is gathering an APR of almost 70% in Binance. Let's go to Polygon. Polygon has improved a bit. The yields are okay. 
slight improvement in yield slight improvement in ROI. so this is like the tortoise of a long race now let's look at Terra the big news Terra Luna version 2 is here dropped I don't know what the criteria is I was holding 200 USD so maybe currently I have been airdropped 2.64 Luna version 2 which currently sits at almost $10 so that is some consolation $25 are recovered out of 200 and by the way the, these $200 are the total investment of $200 is uh, sitting at only $13 dollars these two are not added let me just correct this formula so a total investment of 212 dollars is 13.86 in terra some consolation yield some consolation roi because of this airdrop so you can guess you can get a rough idea of how much airdrop can you expect the $200 of USD then Tron is holding up pretty well it is a very very robust uh, chain as you can see an investment of 100 is sitting at 92 brilliant performance and a yield of 8.48 we are into only week number 16 here just look at this so it is giving us profit total I value plus total yield is above 100 so brilliant chain Tron with only two uh, cryptos Tron and BitTorrent holding up pretty well they are yielding well above 20% in OKX and Binance so this week's winner is also Tron let's look at the total picture a bigger picture a total investment of 1586 is sitting at $900 and so far we have been able to accumulate yield of $119 so we are into huge losses here this is the CSV for ROI and yield we are in week number 16 and let's see now this guy has jumped a bit this is Terra and Binance is doing pretty well Terra is jumping exponentially as far as the ROI is concerned ROI does not include the live values depreciation so that is how it is it will be interesting to see these charts move forward for another 90 weeks so this was all about this week's update I hope you liked it if you want to download this spreadsheet which can track your progress in crypto winters uh, you can do so by clicking in the link in the description I'll see you around in the next video take care bye bye